Was there much debate in the inner circle about the appropriateness of Manny being honored as the star of last night's show, given his non-baseball track record? Boy, it's uh, back to the future, huh? Yeah. We're psychoanalyzing uh, uh, Manny and decisions about Manny. We have been all morning, Larry. Oh, you have? Yes. Okay, well... Uh, uh, let me say first that it was a, uh, a great uh, experience. Most of the players were here for uh, two days. Mm -hmm. There was a, a wonderful dinner the night before uh, when they, uh, it was a bit like a, a high school reunion, a bit like a locker room celebration. And that was uh, that was terrific. And then we uh, had the public event uh, yesterday. Um, I, for one, enjoyed uh, almost every minute of it. Winning those uh, two games certainly helped uh, quite a lot as well. But uh, the, as the decision on, on, on Manny, you know, there are so many people that could have thrown out the first pitch. It's, uh, you know, Jason was the captain. Uh, Kurt Schilling has gone through some extraordinary uh, uh, times these days. Um, Pedro is always enormously popular and charismatic. Uh, but the, uh, the simple fact is that we were honoring the championship, the World Series championship of 2004, and the MVP in the World Series was Manny Ramirez. So that's why you picked on me. I think you're right. Great candidates. Pedro Schilling would be one and one B on my list. I can't believe a guy who, you know, clearly he quit on the team many times over. Uh, a guy who only cared about himself becomes the guy, uh, the focal point. It just it seemed bizarre. And I said this earlier, Charles Steinberg, Sarah McKenna do a brilliant job. I rarely, if ever, have had any uh, criticism of their you know, ceremonies. But this one. Larry, what, that that was a disgrace to let that become about this bum, this 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 guy, who Manny Ramirez, who quit on you guys on a number of occasions. Well, I don't say this very often, but I respect your opinion, Callahan. I just don't. Uh, 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 a choice has to be made among several um, um, candidates who were uh, fitting or appropriate, and uh, I believe the uh, decision turned on the uh, World Series. Um, MVP as a as the rational well that's a, that's what we were honoring the World Series championship and that seemed to be the uh, uh, a rational decision was was Kurt asked, would never please everyone you know that that's true well, no usually you do though and the, well, Charles, I don't know Charles Steinberg the, has the best like record that. of anybody I've ever Charles Steinberg he's done this whatever a hundred times he's ninety nine out of a hundred in my opinion and I I was you know Kurt. Dina was going to ask you, was Schilling asked? Because and did he decline, or was it was he not a consideration? Or was he not asked? I think uh, there are several people, as I understand it. I mean, the, uh, the planners of the event considered uh, several ways of doing it from start to finish and several possibilities of uh, how to end it. Uh, it, it was such a uh, an appealing scene with all those guys out there in uniform. Um, but uh, I think it was it, it really turned on what we were there to honor and uh, and the performance on the field. Not that it really matters, but was the Johnny Damon interception of the first pitch scripted by the organization and Charles, or did the idiots come up with that themselves? You know, I don't know the answer to that. I believe it was uh, a scripted uh, by the organization, but uh, I don't know. I was surprised to see it. I didn't know that was going to be an element of it. Uh, Manny coming out of the uh, out of the Green Monster to begin with, and then Manny uh, uh, having his pitch uh, uh, cut off. By Johnny Damon. Well, I thought it was a uh, it was a fun moment. Do you do you think there's going to be a point, Larry, where Lackey wants to renegotiate this deal? You look at him. I think he's the best pitcher on the team. Right? I think he's been the best pitcher on the team since last September, October. At some point, is he going to say, "I can't make this much money. I have to make this much money going forward"? Well, uh, I don't know. I uh, you know you'd have to speak to his uh, his representative to see if they're considering. Uh, uh, that uh, I'd rather talk about his performance and how extraordinary it has been. I mean, he was a, uh, a, a, a roundly criticized at one point in, in his career, but we always knew what a gamer he was and what a uh, uh, what what talent he had. And uh, he is among the most uh, uh, the best liked and most respected guys in that clubhouse. And that may surprise some fans to hear that, but. Uh, uh, that is that is indeed the case. Uh, it, I think there was an informal poll taken uh, uh, a while ago. Who's the guy on the team most likely to pick up a check, no matter how many people there are there? It's John Lackey. Right. Um, so uh, we, I always feel an extra sense of confidence when it's Lackey's turn in the rotation. For more, visit weei.com/video.